So, hey, Mr. Krause. Um, you'll always be Mr. Krause to us. Um, it's Joni Higginbotham. I guess, uh, pretty sure that your first year at Brookhurst was also my first year at Brookhurst. Uh, so, of course, we were the best class, right? Our seventh grade class was the best that you ever had, I'm sure. <laughs> um, anyway, I just wanted to say congratulations and, um, you are a wonderful teacher. You made seventh and eighth grade, not just bearable, but, but, you know, a, a, a wonderful time that I look back on fondly. Um, we really appreciate you. And I just hope that this next, uh, adventure in your life is just even more wonderful than everything that you've already had, everything that you've already done. So, uh, congratulations again. And, um, I just hope you have a wonderful life. Thank you. Okay, so my one story about Mr. Krause is um, I only had him for eighth grade, and but my story actually isn't but for in high school was one time when we were at Disneyland with the high school, the junior high students went with us, and a group of my friends, including me, Candy Black, and Joni Higginbotham, still now, were in line at the Pirates of the Caribbean and Mr. Krause was in line in front of us and Joni kept staring at him and staring at him and he had his Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds tie with on him. And I had seen him wear it before and Joni just was staring and we were all just talking to him and all of a sudden Joni just blurred out, LSD, I get it now. And everybody just started laughing and he just turned bright red and it was the funniest thing ever. And so that is actually my story because that's what I remember. I mean, I remember a bunch of things. He taught us a lot. He was my introduction to band. And from there, I went obviously into band into high school. I didn't continue, but my nieces and nephews continued and they did band. Um, it was a fun experience and I loved it. And thank you, Mr. Krauss, for introducing me to the world of music. Thank you and hope you have a happy retirement. Hello, Mr. Krauss. If, if you are old enough to retire, uh, I must be past ancient <laughs> as a one time junior high student and subsequent junior high teacher and only uh, a couple of millennia ago a uh, parent of four of your students I can truthfully say that you are the best junior high teacher I have ever met uh, you always saw the best in every student that you had and you got the best from them you let them take risks that could be potentially embarrassing in a safe and secure, controlled, supportive environment. Thank you so much. Yes, thank you, Mr. Krause. Thank you, Mr. Krause. Thank you, Mr. Krause. And Lawrence says thank you as well. He wasn't able to be with us, but uh, he really appreciated you as a teacher as well. Yeah, and I may not be playing music as a performer right now, but I'm a roadie for a band, so I definitely owe that career to you. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Hey, Mr. Krause, congratulations on your retirement. I wish you nothing but awesomeness in this next chapter of life. And I'm only about 5% better <laughs> that you won't be around to teach Lily music. I was asked to make a short video for you, which seems impossible considering I have so much to thank you for. I've made lifelong friends that initiated in your class. There will never be enough words to express my thanks to you, not only for myself, but for my kid. What an honor it was to have you teach Anthony music. Teach, inspire, drive, and accountability, all words that come to mind that describe you. You teach like no other. You inspire to create magic with music. You create a drive to always improve and you push for accountability. You want that solo? Show me. Thank you for the gajillion hours you kept the band room open after school for practice. Thank you for the week solid you sat with me to teach me triplets when I just couldn't seem to get it right. 
Jazz songs like Louie Louie, Freddie the Freeloader, and In the Mood will always hold dear to my heart. Wind ensemble tunes like Rhythm of the Winds and all those wonderful Christmas songs, same thing. You are truly one of a kind and irreplaceable. Congratulations. Hi, Mr. Krauss, Karen and Dave Sibrel here. We just wanted to say congratulations on your retirement. Um, we had many, many wonderful times with you. And if it weren't for you instilling the love of band into us, we actually wouldn't have met, gotten married, and the rest is history. So thank you and enjoy. Ser seriously, congratulations, Mr. Krauss. Um, well-earned retirement. Enjoy life. Hey, Mr. Krause, how are you? Jeff Menendez, and I uh, just want to thank you so much for just the impact you had on myself. I'm sure and countless of other uh, students who've gone through your program. Um, I'm here at the church I play drums at, um, still playing, and I know I started on clarinet, but I want to thank you because I actually got kicked out of an orchestra playing clarinet two years prior to arriving at Brooker Junior High and you gave me a second chance. I, I thought that after I got kicked out, no more music, that's it for me. And then I got the chance, second chance with you there playing clarinet, which of course left me playing drums and doing drums from that point forward. So thank you so much. And also one more thing too, I remember when I uh, started, I started a beginner band in eighth grade and an intermediate band, uh, second semester in eighth grade. And I, uh, you encouraged me to audition for the all district uh, junior high band and I did and I made it and that gave me so much confidence so again thank you for the impact thank you for um, to this day music is a huge part of what I do part of uh, my family my girls being into music and everything else so I thank you so much and uh, hope all is well with you congratulations on your retirement Mr. Krause this is Sarah Culpepper then now Sarah McGarrow I got to be in your class in January of 90 as an eighth grader when I moved to Brookhurst. Um, I, some of my fondest memories was being able to be in music and participate in your class. And you really helped make a hard move much less stressful. <laughs> and I also got to see you every year when you came to Marshall with um, the jazz band helping to encourage incoming sixth graders to join Berkers band. And I was, I was there as a teacher for 15 years. So I got to see you guys every year. And it was amazing to see the kids respond to you that didn't even know you, but they saw your personality come through with each visit you made. Um, so congratulations. I hope you have a wonderful retirement. You get to go on lots of adventures. You get to tour around and find lots of fun bands to Hello, enjoy. Mr. Kraus. So excited to be sending you a video and my well wishes for your much deserved retirements. As I was preparing for what to say that would just move me to the top of the list on all those videos that you remember, um, I found a quote that really, really sums up your influence on all of us at Brookhurst. It says a teacher affects eternity. He never knows where his influence will end. And I can say that driving by Brookhurst, living in the area every day, every single day with my children, as I pass by, I remember you. And I remember one very special afternoon um, in jazz band, which by the way, you made me a saxophone player. You asked me to play the saxophone for jazz band even though your sister had um, had uh, turned me on to the flute, you know, when she let me try her flute on that try every instrument day in seventh grade, um, you asked me to be in the jazz band. And so that was great. I was like, the confidence I got from being in this elite group of musicians, and we had a great group. In fact, a lot of us still talk to this day. Um, that was such a great experience in my life. But I remember one day I was having a really hard time and you took me in your office and you said, what's going on, Josanna? Are you okay? And I remember back then I was just a teenager. I didn't know what was going on. It turned out I was just moody. There was no story behind it. I'd had a bad day. I don't know why. Um, but I remember that you cared. And so I know that you probably cared about all of your students the same way that I saw that day. And um, 
that was really influential in my life. Just the time that you took out of your day to care about your students. That doesn't happen um, by every teacher. And I remembered it um, to this day. And I know that we have touched base with each other a few times over the years. And I hope that we run into each other a few more times um, because you are a very special teacher. And Brookhurst and Anaheim and the world has been much better because your influence has been in it and you have affected all of us for eternity. So take care and enjoy your retirement. By golly, you deserve it. Bye. So Mr. Krause is retiring, Steve Krause. I was there between 1990 and 92 at Brookhurst. My name is Dustin Wise. And Mr. Krause was, um, probably my most influential teacher. Um, he opened up a whole new world to me in music, something that helped me create friends for life and um, just nurtured something in me that I never knew was in there. I always loved music, but uh, as a musician from a different standpoint, uh, the drums just opened my eyes to a world that uh, was amazing. And so I've been eternally grateful for that since then. And um, uh, that was one of the best times of my life, being in junior high and uh, being in his classes, um, learning how to read and write and play music. And, um, you know, he, uh, in, in addition to being one of the most influential, he was definitely my favorite teacher. Um, I tell my wife and kids that even to this day, um, would encourage and push when needed in the right ways. And, um, Man, I just, I can't say enough great things about the guy. And uh, even, even decades later, I walked into his classroom as a former student. He's teaching an after school class and he looks at me and says, don't say it. And he thinks, and he says, Dustin Wise. And I said, man, you remembered after all these decades. So um, I hold Steve Kraus in very high regard and um, wish you nothing but the best in your future. And uh, congratulations on a job well done. Hey, Mr. Steve Kraus. So it's Vanessa Sanchez, one of your favorite French horn playing students of all time, I'm sure. So it was the year 1990 through 1992 was when uh, I was there at Brookhurst. And I remember one of the very first days of your band class, you were introducing us to uh, different mouthpieces for the various instruments we were going to be learning with you. And you brought out this French horn mouthpiece. You made your little toot on it. And you asked if anybody wanted to attempt it. And me, I was already a clarinet player and I figured I would just continue with that. But Josanna O'Neill was sitting next to me and she nudged me. She's like, why don't you try it? So I tried it. And then I proceeded to attempt to play French horn for the next six years, all the way through uh, Savannah. Um, but it was really awesome. Um, waterworks are gonna start pretty soon. <laughs> but I, and so many of your students learned to try new things, to do what we could to improve our skills at those new things we were trying. And that's something that you take with you throughout your life. And I know I did. I may not play anymore, but I sure as heck still try new things and I do my best to practice and improve my skills at them. So thank you so much for being a, uh, a really big influence in not just my life, but in the lives of so many of your students, both of you, Mr. Krauses. <laughs> um, yeah, you know, just the, the love of music that we've learned from both of you, our, um, our drive, our determination, 
the friendships that we created in your classrooms. I mean, I'm in my early 40s and I am still best friends with many of the people that were in your class. And that was because of your class and what we did together and how you led us. And yeah, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And congratulations, Mr. Krauses, on your retirements. Your students love you. Hi, Mr. Krauss. I want to congratulate you on your upcoming retirement. This is Kelly Webster. I played clarinet in the band with you um, in 92 to 94. I appreciate everything you did for us when we played. You actually taught me to play. And I just want to say thank you for all the memories that you helped us create and move on through the high school years at Savannah High School. Thank you again and enjoy your retirement. Hey, Mr. Krause, greetings from beautiful Stevensville, Montana. My dog is also saying hi. Um, <laughs> I hopefully this isn't too late. I heard you're retiring and I just wanted to wish you the best. Um, I guess I should tell you who I am. Uh, my name is Christiana Aelfson. Maybe you remember me as the one with the unpronounceable last name. It starts with an E. Um, I can't remember what years middle school were probably like 92 to 94 or something like that somewhere in there um, I was in a class with Emily Otis who's still one of my best friends and Chris Sheets and Andrew Bermond and all those guys so um, band changed my life and particularly intermediate band um, at Brookhurst I had no intention of going into band and I want to say that I didn't start until eighth grade and I just kind of got stuck into band for some reason but the people that I met there became my bestest friends in the whole wide world and I continued um, in high school and really enjoyed you know I just learned so much about myself and leadership and all of that and I really appreciate that you were enthusiastic and occasionally forced me to take scale tests because I was too shy um, and yeah I just uh, you made a big impact on my life and uh, my stepson was in band recently he ended up being a drama kid but that's okay he did try band um, and we would I would evaluate all the uh, band instructors that he had I was like nah, not quite a Mr. Krause but he did have one in high school that was was nearly there anyway uh, I hope all is well in your world and if you're ever in Montana please look me up take care hey Mr. Krause this is Violet I want to congratulate you on your retirement uh, it's time to rest. If you and your family are ever in Puerto Vallarta, let me know and I would love to treat you to a margarita by the beach. Have fun, get some rest, you need it. Hi, Mr. Krause is Tiffany Candless. We were from 1995-1997. I was a trumpet player, and I think you remember me. Our next door neighbor is actually currently in your band class right now. Um, what can I say? As you can see, there's a few of us on here that really want to say thank you for being such a, a very, very awesome teacher. I mean, you go beyond the definition of what a teacher is. You know how to inspire, educate, encourage your students to become better, um, even about 24, 25 years later, there's so many of us that still can recall so many memories about band, like from beginning to advanced jazz band, being able to play at steamers, marching band at, at Disneyland, um, painting the band room. And you let a lot of us girls practice in your class for our eighth grade uh, concert. So that was cool. And one of the cool things that we re uh, really remember is that you made us feel really welcome. You advocated well for us. And um, just like Min says, we we were cool because of you, even though we weren't that cool, especially Min. So what can we say? <laughs> but yeah, um, thank you so much for giving us our voice, helping us find our voice, speaking for us when there were times that we couldn't speak for ourselves. And um, the next generation is definitely going to miss an awe-inspiring teacher. And uh, I want to say thank you. And also of all the accomplishments or any random accomplishments I've ever had, this is actually my favorite of all time. 
<laughs> I'm gonna pass it on to our next friend. Hi, I'm Janice Kawamoto. I was one of your flute players. Uh, I just wanted to say you definitely made such a profound impact in my life. Although I did not pursue music, I did become a teacher. And I aspire to be the type of teacher that you are. So congrats to your much deserved retirement. I'm gonna pass it on to the next friend. Hey, Mr. Gross, this is Tim Strong. Uh, good to see you again. Uh, hopefully this message finds you well. I was, if you recall, I was, uh, I played flute and I played the saxophone. But I just wanted to quickly say thanks and best wishes in retirement. It's hard to pick out a single memory, but I'll just say that every single time I hear sing, sing, sing now, it brings back such great memories. Yes. Um, just wanted to say thanks. Thanks again. Hi, Mr. Krause. It's on Chu and Chai. Hopefully you still remember me. I used to be one of your flute players. Um, I just want to say thank you for all that you do for us, for giving us lifelong friends here. We're still friends today. Um, it's just so great for all of us to be able to find all of us here in your classroom. And thank you for all that you do for all of the kids. Um, have a great ret retirement. You really do re deserve it. Hi, Mr. Krause. It's Michelle Lebyan. Um, I used to play the flute. Um, <laughs> thank you so much for all that you have done for us. You pushed each and every single one of us to just become better musicians. And you can see here also, you're really one of the reasons why all of us became close and are still close, I think. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much for everything and happy retirement. Enjoy not having to wake up super early because I know us teachers, because I'm a teacher as well, like Denise uh, is as well. But um, yeah, enjoy retirement, have fun relaxing. Hi, Mr. Cross, this is uh, Min Trung. I played the trumpet, uh, second chair behind Tiffany, but uh, <laughs> just wanted to say congrats on your retirement. And uh, I'm sure you're gonna be receiving many of these videos, which is a testament to how many lives you've touched. Uh, which is great and like tiffany said you you definitely made us all feel cool despite being in band and we were cool felt cool being in band but now looking back we probably weren't so cool but we definitely felt cool back then so that's all that matters at the time thanks again hi mr kraus it's shane andrade um i was a clarinet player first chair clarinet if i uh I, yes. uh, have to say so yes. uh, and also a uh, saxophone player in jazz band and i just want to want to thank you for all the time and energy and patience you had with us kids i'm sure it wasn't easy teaching a bunch of uh you know junior high kids music but you know here we are 25 years later still like really good friends and you know uh it always brings a smile to, to my face whenever i whenever i think of those times so thank you for everything you did and please enjoy your retirement i'm sure it's very much uh deserved so thank you Hey, Mr. Krause, uh, Priscilla Soriano here. Uh, I was a saxophone player in jazz band as well with Teeny. I remember being the only two girls. Um, oh yeah. Thank you for the great memories and uh, all the great friends that I still have to this day. I think it was primarily because of uh, band. So um, enjoy retirement and you have some outstanding parking tickets that Lori wrote uh, years ago. <laughs> so we'll be collecting Lori. money on that soon. <laughs> Um, and last but not but least, this is Michelle Malolo. Here's my picture. I played the flute. Uh, I was second or third chair. I could never dethrone Jim with the flute. I tried really hard, but didn't happen. Um, and just want to say thank you for being such an inspiration. All my friends here have said great words, great memories. One of my favorite memories, I think, or one of my favorite pieces forever, I think, is um, Into the Storm. Yes. Um, that just was such a great piece uh, to showcase, and it really showcased our talent, um, really pushed us, pushed us to challenge ourselves musically, and I think it was really great. Um, so just really enjoy retirement, like they've all said, um, and just have fun. And we love you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Thank you. Thank you. Your retirement. Mr. Krauss, it was a pleasure to have you as uh, an instructor during those formative years of junior high school. I can't imagine going through that awkward period of time without band, and I can't imagine band without Mr. Krauss. Um, I also really want to thank you for being such a great advocate, not just for me, but for all of us in the band. Um, you're a true educator and went above and beyond for all of us. And thank you so much. Hello, Mr. Krause, Jamal Mustafa here, 9798. I just wanted to say thank you for introducing me to the world of music. 
I think classes like yours pretty much taught me the nice balance between fun and discipline. And I've pretty much used those attributes throughout my entire life. And so any success I have was because of teachers like you. So thank you very much, Mr. Krause. Enjoy your retirement and hopefully I'll see you soon. Have a good one. Happy retirement, Mr. Krause. What can I say? You made band so much fun and you made the term band geek cool because you were just the best. But I'm not just saying that because you're retiring, but um, what made you actually a memorable teacher for me or the most memorable teacher is that back then in junior high, I was going through something, probably something stupid and dramatic, but um, I really needed to use a phone and you let me use your office phone during class to take care of what I needed to and I will just never forget that because that really made an impact in my life. So thank you for caring for your students and thank you for just leaving an imprint in our lives and I wish you the best. Happy retirement and God bless. Hey, Mr. Krause, this is Tanya Alvarenga. You may remember me as Tanya Vergara back in the day when I was like 11 years old, <laughs> but um, I am 34 years old now and I still have the warmest thoughts when I think of you and the big role you had in, in me learning an instrument. I played the clarinet in your band. That's when I learned to love it. Um, that's where my love for music began and grew so much. Um, I continued into high school and um, just absolutely loved it. Uh, you also taught my older brother Marco and my older sister Candy. And we all just loved you and still do because you gave us some of the greatest memories in school at junior high. Thank you for everything. Thank you for your genuine kindness and um, the time you put into teaching your students. You all made us feel, you made us feel all so loved and cared for when we were in your, on your watch. So thank you. Um, now I am pregnant and grown up and married and all that stuff. And I can't wait to um, share the love of music with my baby. Thank you so much for everything. Take care. Happy retirement. Hey, Mr. Krause, it's Travis Boggs here. I uh, just wanted to say congratulations on the retirement, man. Uh, hope you have a great life and thank you for everything you taught me as far as music goes. Um, hope you enjoy it, man. Enjoy that uh, retired life. Um, Hey man, you had a great career as a teacher. You're a great music teacher, man. So I'm, I'm proud to say that I, I took your class and and progressed in music and you taught me how to play trumpet like a champ. So I appreciate you, man. Congratulations. Hello, Mr. Krause. I heard that you were retiring. Thank you so much for all of your years of teaching, and I'm happy to say I'm actually working in film music, so um, thank you for being my teacher. Pan was definitely the best class that I ever had. Um, congrats on retiring. Bye. Hey, Mr. Krause, just wanted to say congratulations on your retirement. I'll always have those fond memories of us playing duets after school, and you taking your extra time to help me out. Thank you for all you've done for myself, for my brother, my uncle, who was also in your class in the 80s. <laughs> um, yeah, thanks again. Hey there, Mr. Krause. Congratulations on your retirement. You deserve it, and you deserve everything that comes to you after. You've done so much for so many people that we can't even think where to begin to thank you. Personally, I want to thank you for starting my music education, along with you and Mrs. Roberts sharing me for advanced band way back when, and then also, teaching my friends are some of my friends to this day so thank you so much congratulations enjoy it and hope to see you soon mr Krause, congratulations on retiring this is such an amazing thing for you you've worked so hard for so many years mentoring so many people changing so many lives teaching music not only how to play but how to love music creating passion in so many others like the passion that you have in yourself i want to thank you for mentoring us um, not only myself, but everyone, because you, again, have made an impact in so many people's lives. Thanks for attempting to teach me piano, but I know that it was a lot, but I still take with me that I can play Louie Louie, and I say, my band teacher in junior high taught me how to play Louie Louie, Louie so I hold that with me. Congratulations, and thanks again for everything. Hi, Mr. Krause, congrats on your retirement. Thank you for opening up your band room every day and hearing our latest rendition of 
the most popular film score at the time. Thank you for making learning fun and giving quality of life in a time where life can be really awkward. You are not just a great teacher or music teacher, but a great leader. Wishing you nothing but the best. Hi, Hi Mr. Kraus. Thank you for making band so much fun. And congratulations on all your years being a teacher. We wish you well in your retirement. Bye. Bye. Hey, Mr. Kraus, this is Jared Gamara. Just wishing you and your brother nothing but the very best on your guys' retirement. Of course, uh, Brookhurst and Ball uh, won't be the same without you guys, but you guys totally deserved it. Um, and can't, can't thank you guys enough for teaching all of us students from, from the past on uh, your guys' legacy. You know, with uh, there aren't that many teachers like you guys. Um, and just me personally, I mean, it all started right here. Uh, with my musicianship and couldn't have been in this spot today without your guidance and your inspiration, you know, from being a trombonist, for, you know, composing an arrangement. You helped me, you helped me where I'm at today. And, you know, it's been nothing but a real pleasure to knowing you and to be working with you here and outside of Brookhurst, like uh, the Cinderella, uh, musical that we did back at Fullerton High School a couple of years ago with uh, one of your kids. So, I mean, and it was a real pleasure to meet you and the rest of your family. It's just been a real honor for me, for me, my brother Garrett, and our mom Vicky, and just to speak beyond all of us, Gamarras, um, just thank you, thank you, thank you for everything for all these years. And Speaking of all these years, surprisingly, this Brooker's Jazz Band t-shirt from 15 years ago still fits me to this day, so best shape. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Mr. Krause, both Steve and Dave, for being a true inspiration for all of us students uh, throughout these years. And I will hopefully catch you guys at the Bourbon Street in downtown Fullerton in the near future. Cheers, you guys. Hi, Mr. Kraus. Congratulations on retirement. I never thought you would finally retire. Um, thanks for being such an amazing teacher, a wonderful part of my life, my journey, and for sharing the gift of music. Congratulations, and enjoy your retirement. You just, you've earned it. Hi there, Mr. Kraus. My name is Moises. I was a uh, Brookish Spartan from 2007-2008. Uh, I uh, just want to say thank you for all the things that you've done. Uh, obviously, you're a legend around in this area. Uh, having worked at a music store, I know how much you've actually gone through and affected a lot of the community and inspired a lot of people, including myself, to continue playing music uh, and to keep it close to their hearts. So from my heart to yours, I hope you enjoy your retirement and everything's golden from here on out. Thanks. Hey, Mr. Kraus. Uh, congratulations on your retirement. Uh, it's Corbin Alexis from Brookers Junior High 2007-2008. Um, I just want to say thanks for everything that you did, everything you did for me. Uh, you taught me how to play tenor sax, you got me hooked on drum set, you got me hooked on drums, um, and I took that into my into my high school year, um, and I couldn't could have done it without you. You know, your guidance and your teachings really helped me to push and learn, to accomplish everything, and to learn something new. And that drive to to learn everything really really helped me in my career. Um, helped me in high school, helped me in college. You know, helped me graduate college. Now in my career, um, so I just want to say thanks. Um, without you, would have been able to do it. Wouldn't have the confidence to do anything without you. Because um, you really cared about everybody. You cared about your students. You you know you cared about them. You wanted them to learn. You wanted them to be passionate about it. You know, you wanted them to just love music. And I do. And I love music. I still love music to this day. Um, so I just want to say thanks, you know, and now you have the time to just, to sit back and relax and listen to your favorite music. <laughs> thanks. Hi, Mr. Krause. Hearing about your retirement was so bittersweet. You've done so much for so many people over the years, but you're more than deserving of a break and some time for yourself. I personally will never be able to thank you enough for putting me on the path that has made me into the person I am today. I truly hope you enjoy yourself and thank you for all that you've done. Hi, Mr. Krause, it's Jasmine Sandoval. I went to Brookhurst Junior High from 2008 to 2010. I was in beginning band, intermediate band, and advanced band. 
One of my greatest memories was making the Wall of Fame for playing all 12 major scales in under one minute. I was the first girl and the first percussionist to ever do it. I just wanted to wish you well in your retirement and thank you for being an awesome band instructor. Mr. Krause from the Chan K family, thank you for all you did to influence the love of music for our family. Four kids went through your program and then went on to Savannah High School. Without you, it couldn't have happened. So thank you and have a great retirement. Thank you, thank Mr. You, Mr. Krause. Krause. Hi, Mr. Krause. Thank you for teaching me how to play the flute. Music became a very important part of my life. I continue to play the flute in my church choir and I love it. I'm also currently teaching special education and I am excited that we have weekly music um, in our program. It is a great therapy for the students. Um, music is so powerful. Thank you for all your, all your knowledge that you passed down. Hey, Mr. Krause, this is Eric Fragoso and I was in a Brooker's band from 2009 to 2011 and I played French horn and trumpet and I can't believe that it's time for you to retire already. I mean, if it wasn't for you, I wouldn't have done music through Savannah and complete a degree in music at Cal State Fullerton. Just want to say thanks so much for all that you've done and you definitely helped my music career evolve into something even better. And great teachers like you are extremely hard to come by nowadays. So hope you enjoy retirement. It's very well Hi, deserved. Mr. Krause, congratulations on your retirement. It's incredibly well deserved. When I came into your classroom, I was new to the district and I didn't know anybody. But because of you and your program, I was able to make incredible friendships that I still have to this day. You are such an incredible teacher and the program won't be the same without you. Good luck in your retirement and best of wishes. Hey, Mr. Krause. So first off, congrats on retiring. Congrats on a wonderful and successful career at Brookhurst Junior High. Uh, first off, I wanna thank you for being that person to put that trumpet in my hand, sit with me for two weeks, teach me French horn because I chose to volunteer that one day. And also thank you for being the first person to put a pair of drumsticks in my hand. Now I was told to make a short video, which is kind of ironic because I have a lot to thank you for. One thing I wanna thank you for is the lesson of work ethic and accountability. With the work ethic, you know, you always said you want that solo, show me. Show me that you want something. With that, I still do that to this day. You know, you showed me that if you want something, you have to earn it, nothing's handed to you. Accountability, you always said 15 minutes prior to the call time, 15 minutes prior to the call time. Today, in my current job, I'm required to be 15 minutes prior to everything. And I just can't thank you enough for starting that habit early because now it's just second nature. I also wanna thank you for the opportunity of putting me in an environment of now lifelong friends. You know, you have inspired not only me, but a countless number of students to just be better and just be all that they can be. You know, congrats on an amazing career. I wish you, your family, nothing but the best in the future, and I hope to see you again one day. Hey, Mr. K, um, I hope you remember me. If you don't remember me, it's Neri. I just wanted to thank you for everything that you've done. Thank you for being such a positive influence on so many people's lives, especially mine. You definitely changed my life. I will never forget that and I will never forget you. Um, so enjoy your retirement. You definitely deserve it and you definitely deserve all the love and appreciation that you get. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you. and. I hope this isn't goodbye. Hi, Mr. Krause, it's Jasmine. I am finishing up my third year in college and I wanted to say thank you for all the years you dedicated to the Brookers Band program. I am super grateful to have learned from you. I still use a lot of the skills that you taught in my everyday life. Not the band skills, but the life skills. And I wish you the best in retirement. Hey, Mr. Krause, it's Matthew Aguirre. Uh, I just wanted to share my favorite story. Um, eighth grade jazz band. Uh, I brought my brother's saxophone in and uh, I was wondering why no sound was coming out and you grabbed it and take a look at it and you like looked inside the bell and uh, pulled out the entire neck and mouthpiece and we we're like, oh, that's why. Uh, and I just thought that was the funniest thing ever. Um, <laughs> and I just wanted to say uh, congratulations and here's to a happy retirement.
Hi, Mr. Gross. I just wanted to take this time personally just to say thank you. Although I was only at Brookers for two short years, you still managed to let me flourish on both trombone and bass guitar, and it's something I will eternally be grateful for and something that I will carry with me for the rest of my life. And I just wanted to say to you to have a great retirement. Thank you. Hello, Mr. Krause! What an amazing journey and what an amazing time it has been having you here at Burkers. This is a shout out to let you know how much we're going to miss you and how much you are loved and how much of an impact you have made, not only in the lives of adults, but in our community and in our students. And so as you can tell from, our, from my eyes and from all the hearts spilling out of them, we are sure going to miss you, but we are very excited as well for you uh, and for this journey that you're going to be on. Please come by anytime. We really wish you the best and hope for you to have amazing adventures and to continue pursuing your passion and, your passion and everything else that you wanna do. So from us to you, congratulations on this retirement and you are going to be missed and you are loved. Hi, Steve. Joe Dudek here, wishing you a happy retirement. You know, one of the things I miss the most about working in the Anaheim district is all the amazing music educators um, over there. Oh, it, and you too, I guess, of course. <laughs> I just wanted to let you know that you're one of the people that I've looked up to my entire career. You're just simply one of the best. And um, again, have a great retirement. Best to you. Hey, Mr. Krause, Mr. Pooley, happy retirement. I'm so proud of you. So glad we got to work together briefly at Brookhurst. While I was there, I got to see you touch kids in so many different ways. You impacted them musically, spiritually, and emotionally. You really connected at a deep level with staff, administrators, community members. I just want to say thank you for your years of service. Enjoy retirement with your family. Get out there. I hope you continue to play music. I hope I see you in the community, especially in Fullerton, maybe someday playing with your jazz band. Well, take care of yourselves and have Happy retirement. Hello, Mr. Krause. We knew this day would come. We are so sad to see you go, but we are so happy that you are embarking on the new chapter in your life. The school will not be the same without you. You're the best band teacher Brookers has had in a very, very long time. We wish you the best, best wishes. Enjoy your freedom, enjoy your family, enjoy your life. Congratulations, we will miss you. Hey Steve, first of all, um, congrats on your retirement. Um, second of all, um, thank you for using me as your sub when I was, you know, at, you know, in Anaheim Union. I'm um, really appreciate it that you trusted me enough to um, work with your kids. And lastly, thirdly, um, thank you for always like being open to answer questions that I had. You know, um, you know, stuff that I still use today and think about. You know, you're you went along with many of the people there in Anaheim. You know help guide me so thank you for that um happy retirement i hope you enjoy it you deserve it and i'll see you around hey steve happy retirement hi steve i'll never forget quite some years ago when i retired from being a teacher you made the most wonderful speech about me in front of all of the school and i've been forever grateful since then you're a great guy steve i wish we could see more of you but happy retirement and remember You'll never have to play Louie Louie ever again. Bye now. Hey, Mr. Krause, congratulations on your retirement. Um, just want to wish you the very best. Wish you a lot of rest and relaxation out there with your family and lots of fun. And, um, you know, I just want to thank you for everything you've done for, for this school and for this uh, music program. I think uh, you've established yourself as the one of our, our cornerstones here in the district. And uh, you've, um, you've made this program what it is today. And, um, you know, I just want to thank you for, for everything you've done for us. Uh, you're an amazing man and, you know, I wish you nothing but the best. I hope you, you know, decide one day to come back and visit us. Uh, our kids will miss you, our school will miss you, and you know the, the music programs here in, in this district are, are going to really, really miss you and your brother. So thank you once again, and um, 
Best wishes. Hey, Steve. I know I was never a student of yours, but I got to see your teaching firsthand when I was an intern. So I just wanted to say congratulations on a great career. And I know I'll see you again, but congratulations on your retirement. I know that you've impacted thousands of students' lives and you've changed hundreds. Um, but there's no real way we could ever repay you for what you've done. So thank you and congratulations on your retirement. Oh, Mr. Kraus, how lovely to have walked this journey with you. I am so stoked that you get to retire and I just wanted to take a moment to tell you how much I appreciate you and um, how awesome it has been to work with you. I um, wish you all the best of luck and I'm certain that our paths are gonna cross again. Um, you're such a kind, gentle soul and I'm really thankful that we had a chance to work together all these years. You inspire me. Take care, be well, and congratulations. Steve Krauss, thank you for all the great memories as an orchestra and band director in the Anaheim Union High School District for the last 40 years. You did so much for the district and so much for me. You rescued me at South Junior High in my early years when I didn't know anything about transcribing solos. You're the best, now enjoy your retirement. Hi Steve, can't believe you're retiring. We're gonna miss you so much at Brookhurst. Thank you for all that you've done with our kids and bringing music into our lives at Brookhurst and especially for my students. Thank you so much for inviting my kiddos into your class and always making us feel welcome. We will miss you. Enjoy your retirement. Hey Steve, remember me? I was your student teacher in 2005 to 2006. It was a great honor to be your student teacher and I know you're gonna get a whole lot of videos from people you touched when they were kids, but I also wanted you to know that you had a great impact on your adult students too. You gave me a chance when really no one else would, and honestly, I don't know that I really deserved one at the time. Um, and since then, I've gone on to have uh, more than a decade of teaching experience under my own belt. I've volunteered in other people's band rooms. I've been a guest conductor. I've gotten my master's degree, and I've probably had well over a thousand students come through my doors, my doors as a band director. And if I had any positive impact them on, on them at all, well, you did too. Thank you so much for helping me become a, a much better teacher and get my te teaching career off to a great start and have a great time in retirement. You've earned it. Hi, Steve. Melissa Palmer here. I sure enjoyed student teaching with you in 2006 and seven. You taught me a lot about patience and perseverance, motivation and inspiration. So I'm surely going to miss you in the music education field, but you've left a really strong stamp with me and I'm going to continue on with all the things that I learned from you. Congratulations on your retirement. Hey, Steve Krause. I can't believe we finally got to the point where one of us is ready to retire. You know, we both had the same hire date, so we've been in this game the same amount of time, but man, you have really earned it. The amount of kids who you've inspired, heck, the amount of teachers who you've inspired, who are either your student teachers or your colleagues, has been incredible. And you've really earned this time. Steve, I wanna thank you for the inspiration you've provided us in the Anaheim Union High School District. As directors, as music teachers, and as your colleagues and friends. You've really given us a lot to aspire to by the way that you've taught your students, by the manner that you've held yourself in, in what's one of the toughest jobs on the planet, I think, and I think you'll agree. So I hope you'll continue to uphold that high standard. I hope you'll continue to always be our friend. I know we've enjoyed it and good luck in earning and uh, participating in this next chapter. Here's to you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Kraus. Congratulations on your retirement. Well deserved. On behalf of the Savannah Band and Color Guard program, I'd like to thank you for your years of service and the outstanding work you have done. That work is evident in the students themselves. The students at Savannah have gone on to do amazing things both there and beyond high school. You've had the opportunity to touch and impact so many students' lives over the years that we just can't thank you enough, Mr. Kraus. The program at Savannah would not be what it is today without everything you have done. On a personal note, 
Although I am saddened to hear that you are leaving and retiring, I do want to thank you for the short time we had to work together as colleagues. And even though I did not have the opportunity to be your student at Brookers, I do want to thank you for everything you've done, our collaboration, and how you've also managed to impact my life. Thank you so much. I wish you well in your retirement. Have fun, enjoy, relax, and I hope you will visit whenever you want. Come back and visit the Brook Anna family. Doors are always open for you, Mr. Krause. We wish you nothing but the best. Take care, and I hope to see you around. Goodbye. Hey, Steve. Um, I just want to say thank you and congratulations for a wonderful career of making music and memories for students. Um, one thing this video project has shown me is what kind of impact you had over so many years um, helping students connect and, and make lifelong friends um, from the, their time in the band at Brooker. Sometimes even if they didn't you know, continue into high school, they still stayed connected. Um, and that's really powerful. Um, I'm thankful for everything that you did for me personally. Um, supporting me, giving me some advice along the way. Hey, are you sure about that new crazy thing you want to do over at Savannah? Um, and uh, I'm, I'm, I'm thankful for the, um, for the start that you gave these kids. You made them believe in themselves. Um, you, made, you, you gave them, uh, you helped them see a future in music because you helped them believe in themselves um, because you were such a big advocate for them and you knew what they could do before they knew it and they succeeded because of that and they could continue in high and you would talk about what you were going to do in high school and you talked that experience up in a way that made students see themselves in that that was what they wanted to do and because of that it was um, it was a really great experience working with you working with the working with the students our shared students um, you know, it was just a wonderful experience, um, and I could not imagine having a, a better partner uh, to do this with than, than you, who I've you know worked with over the last 18 years. So, thank you so much. Um, thank you for everything that you poured into those students, and for supporting the the band program at Savannah too, and coming out and playing your trumpet in the stands at the football games, and um, it, it mattered. And it, it mattered to me and it mattered to those students. So thank you and uh, have a great retirement.